kill you off. I shall not disappoint you. Cao Cao takes the rank of Duke of Wei and succeeds in stabilizing his forces. He defeats Ma Chao of Guanzhong and strengthens his control of the north. While healing the damage taken at Chibi, he prepares for another campaign south. Elsewhere, Sun Quan forges an alliance with Liu Bei and waits for his chance to take the land. But their relations soon sour because of Liu Bei's possession of Jing, which Wu believes should have been theirs. Using Jing as a stepping stone, Liu Bei invades Liu Zhang's Bashu. With that success, he has finally obtained the country he has long searched for. In the north, Cao Cao. In the east, Sun Quan. In the south, Liu Bei. The world of the three kingdoms of Wei, Wu, and Shu have been established. It is rather hard for us to be optimistic given our current circumstances. Where do we strike first? We're surrounded by Liu Bei in the Yi province to the west, and Sun Quan in Jian in the east. And now we have Guan Yu to the south of us in Jin province. Perhaps. Although, if we don't make a move, the chaos will never end. If we will be attacked once we launch an attack of our own, we should refrain from doing so for now. Ha Zhang Lu is in charge of Hanzhong. Compared to Liu Bei, I suppose he's not much of an opponent. What made you think of him, Cousin Dun? Hanzhong. Yes. Hanzhong. I like it, Master Shaho Dun. If we can control Hanzhong, we can use it to hold off Liu Bei's attacks from Yi province. Very well. We shall build up our army in order to invade Hanzhong. Wait a moment, my lord. Doesn't that mean we'll be turning our backs to the east? What's to stop somebody from attacking Hefei while we take Hanzhong? I was thinking the same thing. Eugene, Li Dian, you two work well together. I am certain that you can handle the Wu army's assault. Will you agree? to defend Perfei from the enemy for me. I had a feeling you might ask that. Leave the defense of Perfei to us. I shall do my absolute best not to impede Master Li Dian's efforts. Very well. Our entire strategy depends on you. Zhang Liao, I want you to lead our defense at Perfei. Work together with Li Dian and Eugene to hold off the Wu forces. Yes, my lord. I will defend Perfei with my very life if need be. I suppose I must respect our lord's decision. But I must say, I didn't see this coming. The three of you are to leave for Perfei immediately. Everybody else, head to Tian Shui. We must defeat Zheng Lu and seize control of Han Zheng as quickly as possible. A 
a number of small skirmishes have broken out against Sun Chuan from Chibi to near the Shengzheng. It's only a matter of time before the situation escalates. I've got a bad feeling about this whole situation. Jing province is currently under attack by Master Guan Yu of Shu. If Wu is determined to take the central plains, they are sure to target Pefei. This feeling is not just in regards to the enemy. Master Li Dian. I know that you have earned the trust of Master Cao Cao and other members of our army. However, I have not forgotten about my uncle. He fought diligently for Master Cao Cao until he was brutally killed by you and other members of Lu Bu's forces. I know that this is simply the age we live in, just as I know that you were not necessarily a part of Lu Bu's army. Our Lord told me to let it go, but uh, I just can't turn off my feelings so easily. Master Yu Ejin, do you remember our experience in the Vanguard from before? As an officer who switched sides, I wanted to volunteer for such a dangerous role. In other words, I was not seeking to steal your glory. I hope that you can understand that. Yes, I know. However, I am a man without talent. Therefore, I take pride in charging straight into the enemy lines. That is the one thing I can do to help our cause. What? You and Master Li Dian have been with Master Cao Cao since the beginning. You are both highly valued officers in his army. As such, our Lord has placed complete faith in you both. That is why he entrusted you with Perfei's defense. To say that you are without talent... It... Forgive me. That was rather harsh of me to be so abrupt. Don't mention it. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must go on my rounds. As long as they have such concerns on their mind, we will never be able to come together to defeat U. I must find a way to resolve this situation. Master Zhang Liao, our lord has arrived in Hanzhong and engaged Zhang Lu's army in battle. As such, Wu is likely to make its move soon. I've been getting this strange feeling on the back of my neck. I bring urgent news. The Wu army is advancing on our position here at Perfei. See? What did I say? My hunches are always right. How large is the enemy army? They have taken up position on the opposite side of the Shangjiang. We estimate their ranks to number 100,000 men. What? 100,000. That's 10 times the size of our army. We have to defend Puffet Castle against 100,000 men? Is such a thing even possible? What do you think, Master Zhang Liao? If we remain within the castle, the Wu army will likely rely on their superior numbers to besiege us and launch wave after wave of attacks. That will only lead our troops to become exhausted until we eventually run out of provisions. It would only be a matter of time before we were defeated. Therefore, we should venture forth and take the attack to them. Yes, I agree with your opinion, Master Zhang Liao. Our base on the other side of the river will be engulfed by the enemy forces. We must go to its rescue immediately. I agree. If we can join up with our forces there, we can secure additional troops and supplies. Nice work, you, Eugene. In that case, let us leave the defense of Perfei Castle to the others and prepare to launch our attack. We can augment our forces while assisting our allies in the nearby castles and in Shouchun. Then we can target the enemy commander, Sun Xuan. Master Yue Jin, Master Li Dian, do you agree with this strategy? Yes, Master Zhang Liao. Yes, it sounds good to me as well. Given our situation, holding on to grudges will not serve to do us any good. Thank you for your understanding. Now, 
Let us combine our might and spirit in order to overcome this predicament we currently face. Everyone, this battle is our chance to slay Sun Chen. Call in our allies from Shochun and gather at Perfei. We must reinforce the defenses of Perfei. Can you carry in some materials from the garrison? Defensive positions. <laughs> Looks like you've got quite the stockpile. Men, we're taking it all. My father kept aside. We should use this to make Parfait is replete. I may not have contributed much, but we are victorious. Truly amazing. I am happy to have you in our ranks. this position. Do not allow a single enemy through. We will create an opportunity for the Wei forces to transition to the attack. Cut off Sun Xuan's escape route and isolate them. The enemy is planning something. We must strike first and stop it. What about this? Horrendous again, who, as usual, hold them off. Keep the engineers safe. Hey, this is the moment to attack. 
remarkable. The engineer unit is entirely intact. Not a single man lost. How magnificently you fought. We will head for Xiaoxi Bridge in order to destroy it. If this works, the Wu army will have nowhere left to run. I may not have contributed much. But we are victorious! Very well done, Master Yue Jin. Now, take defensive positions! Let's go! Now is the time to attack! will weaken the enemy greatly. All units, march! There are some enemy lookouts that could interfere with our plan. We need to deal with them quickly if we're to proceed. Everyone, get ready! The Wu forces are attacking! Defense along the banks of the Changjiang are quite stout. I think we may need to abandon our surprise attack from the east. I fight to bring glory to our forces! I may not have contributed much, but we are victorious! Amazing! You are a swift and deadly warrior! <laughs> enemy supply depot where it stands this fort is the lifeline of the way forces I will defend it with my life our target has been determined capturing that area will deflate their morale <laughs> We must withdraw for now. The next time we meet, you will not be so lucky. You are unstoppable! We shall defend this position. Do not allow a single enemy through. Our target has been determined. We're capturing that area will deflate their morale. Too old. 
a success. Now we can send supplies to perfect. I fight to bring glory to our forces. I may not have contributed much, but we are victorious. Words cannot describe your ability. Plans. No matter. We'll just have to do this the hard way. Re reporting. Ooh forces are closing in. Soon. I fight to bring glory to our forces! I may not have contributed much, but we are victorious! Amazing! You are a swift and deadly warrior! Truly amazing! I am happy to have you in our ranks! shall seize control of Pompe and drive away from its lands. The Ooh forces are overwhelming. Everyone, stand fast. Prepare to intercept them. We must prepare for their reinforcements. We need a fortress to fight from. What about this? Let's go, Lu Shu. We'll strike the Wei army from the north. They won't know what hit them. Yes, this is our chance. This plot was all due to Master Shu Shang's steadfast preparations. <laughs> Who forces are coming from the north? Good thing we secured those lights. The way forces went so far as to prepare lights to help thwart any surprise attacks. Put a lot of thought into this battle. Report! The supplies from the mountain fort have arrived. No supply problems now. Let's go! Eyes forward! Wipe these enemies out! Here's 
is our chance to look good. Everyone, commence the attack! Now, take defensive positions! Now, take defensive positions! Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. Now, take defensive positions. Uh, how could I let myself be so thoroughly defeated? The enemy was much stronger than I ever gave them credit for. We've defended Buffet from the Ooh. Everyone, give a victory cry! Let them hear you! We came together to overcome Ooh's larger army. I appreciate the effort that all of you showed today. So, now is the time to attack! The U army is withdrawing from the battlefield. It appears our defense of Puffet Castle was a success. I expected a hundred thousand men to be a bit more of a challenge. Of course, I'm just kidding. I'm simply glad that it's finally over. Not only did we defend Puffet, but we also dealt a massive blow to the U army. That should keep them off our back for a little while. If that is what your gut is telling you, Master Li Dian, I trust it to be true. Zhang Liao. Master Yue Jin, Master Li Dian, thanks to your efforts today, we were able to overcome seemingly impossible odds. You have my utmost gratitude for abandoning your doubts and working together towards our common goal. No, I am the one who should be thanking you. After fighting by your side, I see that we actually make a pretty good team. Ah. Just like Master Sao Sao envisioned it all along. At any rate, I think we have a good chance to finish off U for good now. Indeed. Once again, I look forward to fighting even more battles with the both of you. Huh? What's that? We heard that you were under attack by a massive U army. So I came with reinforcements. However, it seems like the battle is already over. Ah, Master Cao Chu, you have my gratitude. Actually, it was the work of Master Yue Jin and Master Li Dian that helped repel the Wu army's invasion. No, it was Master Zhang Liao's brilliant leadership and valiant effort that enabled us to come together and fight as a cohesive unit. Yeah, that's right. Zhang Liao was actually kind of scary out there. The Wu soldiers fled merely at the sound of his name. It sounds like it was quite the battle. Good work, everybody. Please, take some well-earned rest. I will see to Perfei's defenses while you do. Thank you for your generosity. I think I will take you up on it. Oh, Master Li Dian, I bring a message from our lord. Once things have settled down here at Perfei, he wishes to see you at the castle. He wants to see Master Li Dian? I wonder what this is in regards to. Ah, uh, I think I might know what this is about. We shall see to Perfei's defense until you return, Master Li Dian. Safe travels to you. Yes, thank you. I'll try to be back as soon as I can. Yue Jin fought alongside Zhang Liao and Li Dian to defend Pefei. Their sense of cohesion served to drive fear into the massive Wu army. They had no fear or trepidation in regards to the coming battle. 
Their great victory proved that with the three of them together, Pofei's safety was assured. Yue Jin marched forward in triumph. He was proud to fight alongside his trusted allies, even if he was not the one leading the vanguard. This battle's finally settled down for a time. I cannot believe that the three of us are returning home together. I learned some things that will prove to be rather valuable from this battle. Master Li Jian, Master Lei Jin, I offer you my thanks. I'm the one who is grateful. I can never repay either of you for what you've done. Stop being hard-headed and do your best for your allies. And that is what leads to victory. I understand now. I was obsessed with being first and foremost. I am so ashamed. It was nothing. And I really have to admit, I was a bit arrogant myself as well. If we are talking about faults, I was not as patient as I should have been. That's not what I meant. I'm sorry to have brought this up again. Forgive me. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> There's the castle up ahead. How about I ride ahead now and let them know that we're all coming? <laughs> hey, what's that about? I thought he was through with having to be first. Exactly. 